Hey everybody, it's your man, Mr. Squishy Face here. I'm gonna be your conductor. Oh yeah, pandemonious. Week six. Um, six. So you're back at school? Sucked in because I'm not jealous at all. <coughs> Tilly invited me to her school. Maybe next week I can go. What do you reckon, Tilly? I hope you've all been practicing really, really hard so you can be as good as me. Oh, Mr. Squishyface, you're not playing like a real artist. Let me show you how it's really done. <laughs> Professional recorder player here, Mr. Potato. Mm -hmm. Mr. Potato, that wasn't even that good. I could play better than that before I was even born. Anyway, sweet little children, I'm your conductor. So everything I say, you have to do it, all right? Okay. I really just need to go to the little Squishy's room, so do you think you can wait like one minute? Just give me like one minute, okay? Why is everything set up here for recording? Kids, are you there? Has Mr. Squishy Face been trying to teach you? I bet he's undone all my hard work, is that right? Let me just go see if I can find him and sort this out. Did you guys see Howie? I think he's looking for me. Okay, I'll admit it. I wasn't supposed to be the boss of your band today. I'm just gonna go for now. Now I have to go and tell my 771 immediate family members what's happened and I know they're gonna support me. I'll see you later, okay? Guys, I couldn't find him anywhere, so I think we're just gonna have to go on with the band rehearsal. So, we're going to start with a rhythm workout. This rhythm workout has three different things that you need to remember. The first one is a clap. Anytime you see a note with an accent underneath it like this. The next note is a tap. You can tap anywhere. It could be on your chest or on your legs. Just a gentle tap. And the third thing is a rest. And in this exercise, we go like this. So if we put all three in a row, it'll go. And if there's a few rests in a row, you can go one, two, three. This first one, I'm going to look at the music and do it for you, and then we'll do it together, okay? Now, what are these? That's right, repeats. It means play the whole thing again. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four. I won't bother to do the repeat because we're going to try and do it together now with the repeat. Get your hands ready. One, two, three, four. How is that? It moves really quickly, doesn't it? If you need to rewind this and do that a few times, go ahead. Here's our final one for the day. It also has a repeat. I'll do it first without the repeat, then we'll do it together. One, two, three, four. See how it really has its own little rhythm and story to it. Let's do that one together with the repeat. One, two, three, four. Great work, guys. Who remembered to do the repeat? 
Alright guys, we're going to move on to the song we're playing together for the week, and that will be Angels. Please get your music out for Angels. One, two, three, four. Ready for B? Now. Hear the kick. The hi hat. Everyone, let us see. One. Awesome work, guys. It's not the easiest song, but it is kind of repetitive. I forget how much I like that song, actually. Howie, can I please come back now? I've been really good. Where were you hiding, Mr. Squishy Face? I was looking for you all around the studio. I was hiding in my bedroom, which is the inside of a bass drum. I bet you didn't know that, kids. Every single bass drum in the world has one of my relative Squishy Faces living inside of it. And we don't even care when you kick on the bass drum, because every time you do it, we go like this. Oh, we love it. And it doesn't make our heads go crazy at all. You know why? Mr. Squishy Face, I was literally in the middle of a sentence. So now it's time for dares. Our first dare is from Hamish, and he explicitly said, please, can my dare go first? So here we are. Hamish dared me to dress up Benji and Nushki, my dogs who you met. Put on some shoes. Some running shoes? Yeah, close, close. <gasps> Don't lick me. Benji, are you jealous? Oh yeah. Famous soccer player, Nushki Messi. Da, 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 da. Oh, so handsome. Stunning! You look great! Now we're doing a couple of dares from a while back. Greta dared me to juggle with potatoes, and Tino dared me to do the weirdest jump that I can. Now I've recruited my friend Dean, who's an amazing rapper, to help me out with this challenge. Hey kids, I'm Dean. I'm Harry's mate. And he's passed on two dares for me to do today. So I got the potatoes here, and I gotta get a weird jump. And this is what I got. Try that one more time, probably look like a fish just got caught on the line. Now we're gonna juggle potatoes. Here we go. All right, there we go, guys. Thanks for watching. Any other dares? Let me know. 
Thanks, Dean. Thanks for helping us out. Zimmy has dared me to lick my elbow, but I just feel like my elbow wouldn't be that tasty, so I'm going to give this one to Mr. Squishy Face because I know he's really craving some attention right now. Lick my elbow. I don't have any elbow, see? Okay, I'm just kidding. Mr. Squishy Face, your tongue is ginormous. For my next dare, I got Grace to help me out again. Our dare is to make a bowl of cereal with our eyes closed and one hand behind our back and we can't use it. Yep. Ready? Spaghetti, go. <laughs> Can we open our eyes? Yeah. Oh, I put too much. <laughs> Our next dare is from Arav, who has dared me to play my saxophone without the mouthpiece. Let's see what happens. Here's my Sopranino saxophone. I'll take off my mouthpiece. Bye bye No reed. No mouthpiece. Oh, you can see all the way through. Let's see what happens. Okay, it's pretty airy. Let me try and sing. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, if I sing one note and move my fingers, listen to how weird my voice sounds. Now, if I haven't done your dare yet, I haven't forgotten about you. I'm trying to get through as many of them as I can. Keep them coming in because they give me a really good laugh every week. Do you guys remember the cringy rap that Tully asked me to do where you all submitted lyrics for Mr. Potato, starting with, Hey everybody, I'm Mr. Smelly? Well, I've had a request for us to do a love song. This one is for Mr. Potato to sing. And it's going to start with this. Oh my nachos, I love you. So, you need to come up with a line that rhymes with, Oh my nachos, I love you. We'll put it together to make a beautiful terribly romantic song. And I'm sure Mr. Potato is going to get a big surprise when we ask him to do another song. Now, Mally, you have given me some amazing dares this term, and I have done some of them, but I know there's still a few I haven't done. One of them was, write a piece about COVID-19. And another was, go on to Ableton and make music for a video game that you make up, and then tell us what the name of the video game is. So I'm going to combine these two dares. I'm going to write a piece of music on Ableton. You'll see me writing it. That is a video game about COVID-19. And I'll come up with a name for it too. Here we go. So I'm going to screen record my Ableton and use this keyboard to make my video game song. So this is Ableton. I've chosen an instrument called a Selena. So it's on a setting called Diamond Strings. There's heaps, like mountain flutes. Oh, that's quite nice. Or Lucy. Oh, Lucy must not have been very nice. What about string hole? Ooh, echoey, but I have chosen diamond strings. Look at what I played. Oh yeah, it's looking okay. Let's hear it. Listen to this. If I put an arpeggiator on it. That sounds cool, but I might play them as a chord. Hmm, that's cool. But actually, I'm not going to use that. I'm going to add some drums. I might just use a sample. Let's hear the drums with our vibe.
some little effects will be cool too. Whoa. video game so like I imagine lots of running and stuff. Let's put some effects on it. Let's try something else. That's so cool. Thanks, Mally. That was actually so much fun. So that's my little idea for the music for a COVID-19 video game. I don't know what I would call it. I think you should call it COVID video game 19. <laughs> Our next air is from Maggie. Let's see what she has to say. The dare for this week is color one hand with green marker. Colour my hand green? Well, I'm wearing the right outfit. Do you want to see my socks? They're cricket socks. Okay, Mags, look what I've got. Da, 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 da. So here we go. Thanks so much for your dares this week, guys. I hope that you've been having a good time back at school. For those of you who are back at school, sending good vibes out to all of you, and I'll see you all next week. Bye!